Hello Haskellings, it's day two of the Advent of Code 2021. Today we're manoeuvring submarines. Let's have a quick look at the input file. Yeah, this looks like a great time to use a parser. But first, we're going to import the Advent of Code module so we can use our custom interact function. Let's check everything is working. Then we can create an enumeration type for the direction. This will allow us to use the enumeration parser enump. Our parser will return a direction and a number. After reading in the direction, we need to then parse the space character. We can either use the string, char, or even the space parsers to accomplish this. Let's use the char parser this time. We then read in the integer value, and that should hopefully be able to parse our input file. Although I can already see that we might get a problem because down is already defined in the prelude, so let's hide that away. Then we should be able to use parse list on the input lines to parse each line with our new parser. We're going to need then a function that will move a position tuple based on the input. We can use pattern matching to do this quite easily. When we get the forward command, we increase the x position, and the down and up commands then increase and decrease the y position. I'm assuming that because we're in a submarine, down corresponds to positive values. Now all that's left is to do a strict left fold over the input commands on position 0, 0 and multiply the resultant coordinates together. For the second part, it looks like we don't need to change much at all. We just need to add a third dimension to our tuple for the aim value, then simply update the move function to encode the new command specifications. The forward command now needs to move vertically according to the aim value, and the up and down commands now just affect the aim value rather than the depth directly. So that's it for today. Until tomorrow, happy Haskelling!